like a shark in a shrimp tank. Big fish, small pond in the shrimp. Hey everybody, welcome to the post-show wrap-up of The Shrimp Tank. I am your co-host, Ted Jenkins, sitting here with my co-host today, Lee Heisman. And of course, our guest today, Randy Kessler, who's a celebrity divorce attorney, been practicing family law for a long time here in Atlanta. But we also talked today about his new venture, Starsona, which we're going to get to in just a minute. Remember, you can catch a replay of all of the podcasts of all of our some 200 interviews that we've done here in Atlanta at shrimptankpodcast.com. You can always catch us on Apple Podcasts, Google Play, Stitcher, SoundCloud, or especially iHeartRadio, where our numbers are blowing it up. We've had more than 30,000 downloads in the last 90 days and growing right now. So people are catching on to the shrimp tank because this is where you get your MBA, right? Combination of street smarts and book smarts you learn from our owners. That's how you get better at running your business. So what was so intriguing, Randy, is how you started this business. You know, you have... The divorce attorney background, of course, you've had that business, and then all of a sudden you saw a need. If you could kind of tell the listeners, how did that come about? How were you doing this for free, pretty much, for friends, and then you turned it into a business? So I'd represent a football player. We'd go to court, and I'd say, we got to hurry up and go see the judge. <laughs> and the football player would say, but that's a fan. He saw me when I was at the University of Alabama. He wants a, an autograph. I need a minute. And they would always do this, and not only for free, but to their own detriment, because they should be worried about their case. This is who they are. This is the kind of people that make it successfully. And I said, there's got to be a way that the average person can do this without having to stalk them and wait outside the courthouse or wait outside the arena. And, um, and I got in touch with my, my sister-in-law, who was very involved in Silicon Valley, and I found some people out there. And thank goodness I did that, because it would have cost me a bundle to try to hire a law firm or an investment guy or somebody here in Atlanta to try to figure it out. But they took off with it. They ran with it. They built it. I got so lucky with my team. That, uh, so is, what is Starsona? Though? Explain exactly what it does. You go online. You can go find. Go to Starsona.com. Check it out. You find your favorite star. You say, I'd like you to do a video for my child or for my friend or for my brother or for myself wishing me a happy birthday or congratulations on the championship in the high school basketball tournament. And they'll do it. Different stars charge different rates. Our superstar NBA champion Kyle Lowry is a few thousand dollars. Dominic Wilkins is a good guy. He's doing it for $100 right now. Evander Holyfield, if you're a boxer, he'll do you do a video for you. He'll say, keep your chin up and make sure you always hide your, your, your left shoulder. Whatever it is that you want your kid to know from an expert, they'll do it. It's just a super way to do it. The money goes to charity. Stars give it to whoever they want. Um, they set their prices. Sometimes they're more expensive because they're busy. Sometimes you get a really good deal. Sometimes we have specials on. You know, For this week, it might be you know, Pete Rose is 150 bucks. Lots of good stars out there. Check it out. Yeah, I saw that Pete Rose. That was a nice ad. So how does the model actually work? Celebrities make some money, and then Starsona makes some money. How does that work for somebody so that signs we're up? We're very transparent. The celebrity gets 75% of the fee, and, and Starsona keeps 25%, and that's across the board for everybody. Um, you can tip the celebrity. If you think they did a really good job and they made your kids so happy, you can actually tip them. And it's I don't like an think Uber driver. It is, but they don't really need the money. But it's a nice little, hey, I just want to tell you thanks. You really made my kids' day. And, and people are doing it, and that touches the celebrities. You can also yeah, write back and say thank you, and they can write back to you saying you're welcome. Another thing we have that's really cool is you can actually film yourself asking a question. Perez Hilton, what was it like to be a gossip columnist back in the, you know, back in the day and uh, when before there were other gossip columnists? And he can say, thank you for asking me. And you see your picture and his picture interacting and the video is interacting. So it's a pretty cool process. We think it's fun. It's something that has definitely been a long time coming. And you said that even there's also like a sharing parts of this now. Like, like once you get the video, it's yours. there's a social media way that you can share the video with friends? Yeah, you can share it. All you do is you click the share button. You can share a video that's already been done that's on the platform, or you can share yours, or you can put it on the big screen for your, your kid's uh, birthday, your kid's wedding, or whatever it is. You can use it for whatever you want. You can share it on your social media. And that's what's cool. If a star does a video for somebody and they love it, they're going to share it, and all of a sudden the star gets the extra social attention and people are going to request more. It makes the star even better. It's, it's the new social media. It's instead of Instagram where you got to come up with stuff to say, this is, I'm going to tell you what this little kid asked me to say. This little kid asked me to congratulate him on getting a hole-in-one at Putt-Putt Golf. And look how happy he was because we're putting fan reactions on there now, too. Yeah. It's, uh, it's just a win-win-win. It's well, a feel good. a lot better than giving someone the Jelly of the Month Club, don't you think? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, or the Shave Club. Or the what, I found, what I found so interesting, again, as, as you started this lawyer, now you become the serial entrepreneur, <clears throat> what I really found intriguing is listening to not only – you have really two sets of clients. You have the, your, your actual talent, which is a client of yours, and you right. also have the end user. And by listening to them, and you said even some of your own talent said, hey, we think a better way for you to do this is to give me a, um, you know, a, a board that I can read right, Like a of. teleprompter. A you teleprompter. Have ideas from them. They love it. They want to be able to share it. They wanted to be able to turn off the sharing. So we listen to the talent. But you know what's cool 
is whenever I tell somebody about it, everybody that's not famous knows somebody who's famous, and everybody that is famous has fans that aren't famous. So it works both ways. We don't have to market this to celebrities or market this to the fans. The whole world gets it. Everyone wants to know what's it like to be a celebrity. We all want to touch a celebrity. We all want a celebrity to be, you know, our friend. And you can get this little meeting with a celebrity and you have it forever. It's not like you get an autograph and you put it away in a scrapbook and you hope to find it someday. It's now saved by Facebook and it's saved by Twitter. Wherever you put it, it's there. Randy, what's the biggest thing people watching need to know if they're thinking about developing an app? Do something you love. <clears throat> you know, if you're out there just thinking, I just got to find a way to make money, you can look around. You might do it. You might not. But if you're passionate about something, and I'm passionate about helping these guys. I lecture a lot for the NFL Players Association, for the NBA Players Association. I talk to them about family law issues. And I see how they really need some experts to help them, you know, mature really fast. They make a lot of money at 21 years old. I love that. And I love the fact that I'm finding a way to help them. The people that used to be famous 20 years ago that did something really big when they were at University of Auburn, but now they're not really making it so well. They still are making people happy when they say, happy birthday, right. I'm, I'm from Auburn, and I love the Auburn you know, Tigers. Uh, it, it, they're still relevant. It makes them feel good. It makes the fan feel good. It's just a, it's a happy place. So if people want to jump online or get in touch with you guys over there at the company, how would they do so? Starsona.com. And you can reach out to me, Randy, at Starsona.com. Or, or you can find me any way you want. You can and you can also at- pay $5. For Randy, if I'm wrong, he so, can give you a personalized message. Yeah, full, full disclosure, I, I am on there, but that's really so that when I meet a star and I want to show them how it works, I can show them the star experience. So, yes, I am on there at $5, and I do have some people that have called me and asked me for some shout-outs, and it's been sort of fun. And, and, and they tip you more to maybe not do something. Is that right? <laughs> there are people, yeah, they might want to find you and say, hey, will you do a shout-out to Randy Kessler saying, don't do any more shout-outs. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, look, for our entrepreneurs out there, you just have to remember that the future of business is you becoming your own media company. I don't care whether you're a lawyer, you own an IT company, or you own a financial services company, you must become a media company, which is why apps like Starsona are going to be so big because everyone out there has fans, and every one of you that owns a business needs to learn how to become the star of your show. I highly recommend in the next 60 days that you download something called bombbomb.com, doublebomb.com, and start using it to send videos to people and wishing them a happy birthday until you become a celebrity and you can get yourself on a place like Starsona. And use the Starsona app to be able to make yourself different by sending celebrity videos to your customers. Don't send them a gift basket full of peanuts and popcorn. Nobody wants that. Send them something that makes you different because the future of being a successful entrepreneur lies in part of you becoming your own star of your own media company. And that's your post-show wrap-up of The Shrimp Tank. I've been feeling like a shark in a shrimp tank. Big fish, small pond.